How's it going, folks? So I got a viewer request video here for y'all today. I'm going to be checking out a band called Matin Rue Opera, and the name of this song is Kronos. Now, any time a band has the word opera in the title of the band name, I immediately get excited. I, my curiosity is piqued because, you know, I love me some operatic style, some, just the implications of that word alone. You know, I... I can't help myself. I'm like, oh, you know, this this definitely seems like something that I want to check out without a doubt. But yeah, I, so I'd never heard of this band before. And like I said, there's a viewer request. This song was requested by this ranger right here. Thank you. And I'm looking forward to this. So without further ado, let's see what we got, shall we? Rangers. Go. Very interesting song there. It, it borders on 
chaos, but I feel like, you know, the transitions and everything are smooth enough to where there is a rhyme and reason to it, where it, it barely stays on this side of just becoming chaotic. And, uh, you know, I think that's quite admirable that they were able to, to weave such crazy kind of transitions and, and crazy different momentums and styles throughout this relatively short song without it quite becoming chaos. At times it may seem like it, but I don't know, you know, I was able to follow it pretty well. So I thought that was pretty neat how, you know, as a whole, it felt like, you know, one song, it felt like everything flowed well enough to, to where it, it stayed organized, organized chaos, if you will. One thing, I really like the visual aspect of the video. I thought that was really cool, especially when they had like the, that red sun or just the red circle back there. It just looked really, really neat. But yeah, I mean, what a what a wild song. Quite eclectic, in, in my opinion. Um, you know, it starts out very ballad-like. And then, you, I mean, you get a lot of heavy breakdowns, some really heavy riffs and, and drum beats in the song. And then you get moments where the, the riffs are more rhythmic and it becomes a little bit more of like a melodic metal or whatnot. And then what's really cool is then they're in the chorus, not like the pre-chorus, but the chorus proper, I, I think it's the chorus, it, it gets a little poppy. You know, you get a little bit of a pop feel in there with the melody and, and the vibe. But the rhythm of the whole song really has a, a nice groove to it. You know, I constantly found myself just really digging the, the groove and the, the vibe of the song. Just really, really nice rhythm and, and riffs and, and whatnot. And like I said, I mean, you go through a lot of different stages in this song. Ballad, you know, breakdown, heavy riffs, a little more speedy, you know, melodic metal kind of work there and then a, a bit of a, a pop infused chorus so yeah I mean it's pretty wild but those breakdowns you know they, they were really nice and heavy I love the drum work in this song the, I really like the sound of the drums and just the guitar work and everything and then the added touch of the keyboards there's a couple spots that almost sounds like you know synthesizer but then it sounds a little bit more just like keyboard or piano. And there's a couple spots, you know, I, I, my ears could be deceiving me where it sounded like a little bit of kind of like some strings, you know, I imagine it was done with the keyboard, but you could hear it a, a little bit. And I thought that was cool. One thing I will say is this is not operatic, you know, that the, even the style of the song is not really like a metal opera. I did not really get that vibe, but you know, I mean, it's not guaranteed just because the band name has opera in the title. Doesn't mean all of their songs, or any of them for that matter, are going to have an operatic kind of style, uh, whether it be through the music, the structure, arrangements, or the vocals. You know, it's it, not necessarily going to be true, but I will say the, the vocalist, what a range. I, I mean, some real high notes with like kind of a falsetto, a little bit of screamo there. Uh, touch and then just the the other delivery of the whole song you know powerful vocals nice delivery just quite the range quite diverse and again there's a lot packed into this relatively short song you know it really just it almost gives you a whiplash almost that's why I say it, it borders on chaos but it they're able to again just kind of stay on just on this side of chaos and, and giving the listener whiplash which you know i find commendable anytime a band is able to weave something that's so like kind of intricate and so many changes and so many different kind of styles happening all at once but they're able to keep it from just sounding like a mess so yeah i like the melodies and i just like the groove of the song you know it, it the breakdowns were fun, and again, there's just a lot in this song, uh, a lot of different feelings and vibes and, and just moments. Um, so, yeah, it's really different. You know, it's not quite what I was expecting here, but I dug it. It's not really something that I'm going to go listen to a bunch or anything like that, but I can definitely appreciate the talent 
of this band and just the way they constructed the song. And it's a solid song. Like I said, I enjoyed my time listening to it. I like the visual aspect of the video and uh, a lot of the different parts of the, the song itself. And yeah, talented musicians here and really impressive vocals. So it's really neat kind of band. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much to the viewer who requested this song. Uh, let me know, folks, in the comments down below. Are you big fans of Matt and Rue Opera? Ha have you been listening to them for some time? You know, what, what's kind of their deal? Because this is kind of a blend. I mean, there's a little bit of power metal in there, some melodic metal, um, a little bit of speed, and then you, you get like some just heavy metal with the heavy riffs and a bit of not quite screamo, but the quite aggressive vocals in there so there's just a lot happening so I'm curious you know what the band their their typical sound is you know let me know if you're big fans of them or let me know if this is your first time listening to this band just like it, it is mine and what do you think of this song I'd be very curious to hear y'all's thoughts and thank you so much for tuning in I'll catch y'all next time Ranger out